Well, I hope you get the message. It's not that you've got to get the theology right. It's that you've got to be loving, caring, wanting to reach out and rescue others. Because they matter to you, not because of your theology. It's of the heart, you see. And it's what wins hearts. Even if the receiver gets it wrong. Even if they give for the wrong reasons. It's because the receiver has received. His heart is transformed by kindness, transformed into your theology, no, transformed into your presented kindness as he saw it. My mum appeared to me as an angel, to dad she appeared as goodness knows. Not good. Despite the fact he was in love with her. So I come to know God because of mum's kindness as I feel it and receive it. But mum doesn't. I mean, she appreciated Marshall's love, of course. But she just felt I would just grow out of this religious nonsense. Because, of course, the nonsense of religion had inoculated her against conversion even though her behaviour to her son was utterly converted. <laughs> Believe me, when you play life back and you realise you got it right, even though for all the wrong reasons, you're so grateful. It transforms you there and then. Simply the review, going through the record. It's like, well, in a strange way, it's like St. Paul. You realise suddenly, my goodness, I've been persecuting the very God that I, I value. I didn't realise. But you can be loving and caring for the very God. You didn't value. And now you realize. So I expect to find my mum in heaven. And I should be very troublesome if she's not there. <laughs> <laughs> to which they will say quite simply, oh, well, what do you wish to do about it? Oh, do I have to return to do it? No, you don't have to. Oh, yeah, I know what that means. <laughs> oh... I don't think God needs me to be doing it. Surely he's got it all sorted. Are you saying I need to do it? Give me a selfish reason for going.
I'm not up to this decision, Lord. I really am not up to it. Could I ask something before I choose? Would you promise me that at all times I will know your black presence? I don't think I could cope. I know that means being virtually an avatar before I start. But it's not too hard for you, is it, God? so that I can run the race in joy. Ever knowing you. Love you, Dad. Thank you, Heavenly Dad. So Marshall didn't have to go because that was the right answer. Well, it wasn't just the right answer. It was the right state of being. By the grace of God. <laughs> Thank you, Heavenly.